Alright guys, we are getting ready to go green flag racing here from the nationwide series here from Michigan, a wide track just like California. We're gonna see some crazy racing here today from the Michigan Hills. Irish Hills. So let's get it going, baby. Let's go. Racing from Michigan. <laughs> Here we go, Green Flag is about to come out. Here for the Nationwide guys. Here, 30 laps. This again. Levi Scones will lead us off in the 78 Furniture Road Machine. Right by, right next to him, last week's winner. is already on to a momentum streak. And uh, on that outside lane. Oh, we got caution already. And these guys didn't even take the Green Flag yet. And we already have caution. Whoa, what is go whoa? Oh Oh Holy crap. Oh god, don't reckon there. Caution. Oh man, we just we just had a ten. Oh, and they're reckoning. Oh my God! What in the world? Now, this is what all happened at the beginning right here. It looked like looked like Cody Lamas and Richard Johnson got in each other on the on the initial start, and then I just uh, Jessica Shelton involved as well along with Chris Kyle uh, that's Johnny Gardner right there along with Richard Johnson but then there was more to go on it happened with the 41 car Justin Talampus he and Chris Washer are banging doors right here I don't know what's going on there and then Chris Washer just spins him out Oh, he's gonna hit the back. His car's gonna hit that wall, and then he's gonna come swerve, boom! And actually, catches Chris Washer right at the end of that. Oh, and then the 15 hits him. Uh, and then there's gonna be another big hit by Cody. There you see the 41 toppling over right there. The nine is Sean Henley. There's the two Cody Llamas. This all happened on the first lap too. Know how many people are gonna have out the race? But they got those guys sitting there. I don't know if Chris Washington gonna be out of the race or not. But uh, then these guys wrecked under the. I think it happened back here with these guys. Yep. Uh, Trent Dunham and Dylan Po. No, Trent Dunham and uh, J uh, Joshua. P yep. No, it was right there. No, no, Dylan actually saved his car. Oh, but it was the 34 and the 99 that goes in the wall, so, yeah. So, I believe that was it, so we will take you back to the green flag. On this restart, these guys can learn to give a little bit of uh, room, I believe you could say, on restarts here. But, these guys are going hard again. And you see that the 40, the 40 still holds the lead right now, but... And there's a lot, lot of stuff going on right back in the back back there. There's Andres Allen, Ian Dutta, Ian Dutta, stick it to the bottom. These guys, oh no, not again, not again, not again. Oh, somebody got the you know, oh, oh, not again. Oh, Dylan Young, Jesus, those guys got lucky. And you gotta watch this corner too. Oh man, these guys. Man, these guys did not be given any room right there. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh it'd be a lot of contact off that corner right there. Jeez. Now, this is the racking corner right here. Oh my god. Oh, oh. This ain't gonna work. What the hell are these guys doing? Some of them are coming down pit road. That's just going on. Some of them didn't come down pit road last time. That's going on. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
Ian Dutta has the lead right now. And how fitting would it be for him to go back to back right now? Got a lot of these guys. And I don't know why they're going that close to the wall for it. It's kind of weird. But anyway. Ian Dutt is still in the lead right now. But I don't know when he's going to have to pit. Because here comes Nick Barney back to his inside. And Nick Barney going to get to the inside of him. And maybe going to knock around with him for a little bit. But they're still side by side. Ian Dutt is still has the lead. And how about Eric Burton in that third position right now? Now you see Dylan Young. You see Dylan Young right there. And try to make a move. A lot of these guys are actually. 31 has a lot of damage. And where he got that from. But Ian Dutta still holding the lead right now. He's trying to go back to back in wins here in this series. But uh, he's holding on to the lead as we speak right now. So he's, he's doing a lot of things right right now. Oh man. I thought we were under caution. There's a bit of there's 31. He has a bit of damage. Oh, wait, that's coming. Wait, that can't. Oh, we got a wreck. We got a wreck. Somebody's wrecking in the back. I don't know who that was. I think that was Eugene the Max in the 90 of, uh, the not, yeah, the 90 of, uh, Chris Kyle who just wrecked there. But, uh, Ian Dutt is going to come across and Ian Dutt is going to lead this lap, lap 11 right here as the car is going to come out. These guys actually win a green flag run a little bit since the, uh, Green flag came back out about lap six. Guys want a green flag run a little bit. So, uh, let's see what happened back here with Eugene the Max. That's not a great side for him in the 35 machine. A wrecked car once again. So, let's take a look at what happened to him. Looks like these guys are slowing up. Looks like the 35 was slowing up, and then Dylan runs in the back of the. Well, yeah, I don't know what Dylan was doing. He ran in the back of the 99, and 35 got turned hard into the wall by the 90. Back that up one more time. I really, I really don't know what that was. But uh, got it from TV One here. You're going in the corner right here, and you can see right there, and it's showing up. Dylan's gonna run right in the back. I think it was a chain reaction. And he's gonna, <laughs> Dylan's gonna hit the wall, and then oh, right there, hard in the wall for both of them, and that's gonna bring the caution out. To break for Eugene the max. Eugene was actually running in the top 20 when it happened, but it took a while for the second caution to come out. But at least it was a little caution this time, not a big wreck. But uh. McDonald's Ford Taurus torn up here today for Eugene the Max. Let's take you back to Green Flag. He's got a pit in, so we're gonna look at. I don't know who's out there. It looks like everybody's pitting too. So It looks like everybody, I mean, everybody has come down the road, so. Me and Dutta is just pissed off. We'll go, by, we'll go with somebody that's pissed off a little bit further up. Looks like Trent Dunham is not pitting. Where's he at? 09 actually, 09 actually beats everybody out. Look like he just took fuel and got off. There's Ian Dutta, and Ian Dutta has lost a lot of positions on pit road. But it looks like the 19 and the 09 of uh, Rob Williams and, and uh, Deion Scott have done something right on pit road here. But we'll take you back to green flag. Did you better guys lap down from that lap? 
and uh, these guys are going to be real slow on this restart, oh boy. Trent Dunham, Trent Dunham is actually the leader. There he is right there, he's in the middle of the pack right now. There's a 40, who's second right now, oh, oh boy, oh boy. It's close right now. Oh, the 8 just wrecked, oh my god. Hey, oh, and these guys, chill out guys, chill out, don't wreck each other. Oh, oh my god, oh man, don't wreck each other, come back to the line, we just had another caution. Oh boy, oh my goodness, coming to the line, uh, Trent Dunham is not the leader, it is Ian Dutta the leader again, there he is right there, and he's got to slow down, slow the hell down, slow down, what the hell y'all doing, oh, 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 whoo, they almost racked again, whoo, wait, is that Trent, Trent, somebody was spinning, that was almost Trent. Trent almost got turned. But Ian Dutta has the lead over. Uh, no, wait. It should be Zach Rogers who got the lead. No, actually, it's Ian Dutta. Never mind. Uh, Ian Dutta has the lead over Zach Rogers in the 18. Uh, let's take a look at what uh, what happened to bring this out. These guys are going three wide here. It just went bad. You got these guys going three wide again. Andre Erickson on the inside. And you've seen the inside get a good run here at this place. But it looks like they weren't clear of the 26. And there you go. And yep. I thought four wide was bad. That's the first time I've seen a wreck with them going three wide. But it uh, looks like Zach Lang oh, oh, you oh, and Eugene actually hit his teammate right there, the 25 of Ryan Acosta. He went, oh, uh, Ryan Acosta went, he almost went over Ryan Acosta. And Jessica is driving her wounded car up into the, oh, up into the 21st position. We'll bring that back one more time. Yeah, Jessica got involved in the wreck on the beginning of the race. Take another look at that, and then we'll ride on board with uh, Eugene the match. Yeah, Jessica was actually up in there. Oh, she got wrecked. Jessica Shelton got wrecked, along with uh, Jason Trost and uh, uh, J. Cole. I did not see that. And then there was another wreck up here. Didn't see that. There you go. Lost 25. Right there. Get hit by the 83, then the 35. Riley Houston. And then Eugene DeMax. We just had a terrible run here today. Let's uh, back that up one more time. Okay, go on board with him real fast. See what he's seeing. Oh man, he was almost through that too. That's a tough break for Eugene. There's going to be a few more cars out of the race after this one. Back down, guys, on the inside again. Green flag is back out once more. You have to watch these lap down guys because they're gonna try to be faster than the leader. Ian Dutta is gonna have to get a better restart. He did not get a great restart at that time, and these guys are gonna be three wide. 78 going three wide. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah, I think they make it through that corner out. Oh no, oh no, 39. Woo. Oh, but, oh, but the 32 is running with the 18 right now. Oh, oh, he runs up the racetrack. Here comes the 18 down there, but the 32 is still in the lead. The 33 going for the... They're four wide for the lead. Who's going to have the lead? Oh, 58. Barely got the lead. They're four wide still going in the corner. Beating and banging. And Dutta. Still up at the top. Oh, the 33 beats and bangs with the 18. Con 
contact again. This is racing at his finest, but Ian Dunn has got the lead out of all of that. Dylan Posty's not even on the lead lap. He's racing up here. Oh, and it's three wide again, but Dylan, Dylan Posty not even on the lead lap, and he's faster than half of these guys up here. Oh, contact again, almost. Here comes the 30 on the inside. Chris Jones goes to take the lead. Here comes Dylan. Trent Donald. Trent Donald goes to the lead. There's contact. They're hitting each other. Oh, 22. Here he comes. Trent Donald going for the lead. I haven't talked about him all day. He's surging. And Trent Dunham is going to go to the inside. And he's going to take the lead. No. No fight in front of the 30 car. But back up in the second position is, is third, well, third position. No. But Trent Dunham has the damn lead. Where the hell has he come from? I have not heard of Trent Dunham all race. And he's gonna keep going, try to come out of here. If somebody just hit the wall there. Ian Dutta dominated most of the race here today. And this race uh, ties uh, with the most cautions at three. Yeah, this race has three cautions. I'm not sure we, we have a chance for another one to come out and we can restart this race, but. I don't know, Trent Dunham's better hopes that he has enough fuel to get his ass to the finish line because <laughs> this is real chugging chugging time right now. And he has really got to go. But I've seen a lot out of Trent Dunham here in this race and I really like what I've seen out of him in this race. And uh, oh, it looks like he's coming down. Yes, he is coming down. The 30 is coming down. If these guys could make their pit stops right, it might help them in the long run. Because all these guys are pitting together. Uh, looks like, uh, I don't know, I don't know who's next to get off pit road. Ian Dutta is the next one. He's just a little bit far behind them, but I don't know. I don't know if he's going to pass those guys who just pitted. Trent Dunn's going to have to hurry up and maneuver his way out of pit road. There's Andres Allen. Haven't talked about him too much. He's ran pretty solidly up into the 13th position. And I like what I've seen out of that kid all season long so far. And he's still impressing. And uh, this is a 66. And J. Cole, after his little damage, he's 22nd, though. Trying to find the leader. The leader is still Trent Dunham. I think he just he just got out of pit road. And he got these guys passing him, but they're uh, they're a lot by almost a lot behind them. I don't know if they're gonna have to lead when they come out of pit road. There's Trent Dunham. Uh, yeah, there's Trent Dunham. There's Zach Rogers up there. Oh oh oh. I don't know who's going to have the lead, to be honest. Rohit Vaderview. Oh, I thought he was up there running for the lead. Oh, oh, Kyle Thomas has the lead right now. Kyle Thomas trying to go for his first Nationwide Series win. But he is going to have to hold off. This guy right here, Ian Dutta. Right behind Ian Dutta is the 40 machine. Then it's Trent Dunham. But Trent is making moves right now. He's going to try to get up there before the end of this race. You can see right uh, right there, Kyle Thomas trying to hold on to win this race. Win his first Nationwide Series race. He's coming to lap 27. He has four laps to go. We have had three cautions here in this race. Tied the truck series with the most cautions. And we had a big, big incident at the first wreck of the day early in the race but um those incidents oh, oh we got a wreck another wreck and it does not look like Kyle here Kyle Thomas 
He has got to hold on. Trent Dunham's catching him. But it's going to be Kyle Thomas winning the race. Oh, we just had a big melee back there. But Kyle Thomas wins his first race of the year and then the first race of the year and this race breaks the caution barrier with four. Yeah, with four cautions in this race. And Kyle Thomas is looking like he's gonna take the win here today. We'll be back to make sure that he wins this race. Trent Dunham just got close but just short. Gucci. Alright, as we look at this right here, it looks like Tyson Broad was trying to go under somebody and then it went wrong. As we have seen many and many times again. He just tried to go under somebody, he goes wrong, he's trying to go under Jacob Stump. And he's running up the racetrack and Jacob's there. And Jacob's not gonna give him no room and there they go. And there is who is that? The ten no, that is 22. There's the 10 going to hit him. Now he's in the middle of the track. Boom. 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 Now the 66 and then 43 barely missed it. And, and, the, and Andres Allen barely missed it too. I'll back that up one more time. Oh, I thought, I thought John McNamara was going to come in there. But, um, yep, that is the fourth caution, same, same thing, it's been, just been, it's been, uh, happening all day, just no give and take up there, like, like, these guys, they're trying, they're trying to go by him, and the 14 just didn't give him no room, and he, he's trying to slide up in front of him, and then there's no, no way you're gonna do that. There's one, two, three cars involved right there. Four, five, six, six. So six cars heavily damaged at the end of this race. And that's going to end the race here. Big hits for a lot of drivers here today. And uh, it's going to end the race for a lot of drivers. And uh, we will take you two to see if Kyle Thomas will get his first win of the season. Kyle Thomas, as you can see, the wrecked drivers here today that we have had from incidents on pit road and incidents on the track out of the race. But Kyle Thomas will, will get saved right here by that caution because I believe Trent Dunham would have passed him and won the race if that caution didn't come out. But Kyle Thomas gets saved, and that will be the second, the second Joe Gibbs driver to win. You know, fail. Michael Norris is not even part of Joe Gibbs. But anyway, that'll be the first Joe Gibbs driver to win this season. And the 20 machine, Kyle Thomas and his teammate had a chance to add a win as well. There he is right there talking about Zach Rogers. Had a great day here today as well, finishing six. And uh, Kyle Thomas comes out of the blue with pitch strategy and wins this race here today. And that is he's, he's got two wins in two of the series. He's got one in the truck series and now one in the cup series. Uh, uh, the nationwide series. God damn, I fell. But anyway, after a wreck field race, uh, ending under caution, we will see for the cup series race, which should be even more crazy. So, yeah. Sorry, guys. We got to show the results. It's duh. But anyway, some key names. Uh, Ian Dutta had a chance on going for two in a row. He had a strong car all day. Um, uh, who is that? Uh, no, that's uh, Zach Rogers, Kevin White. Kevin White had a great run every day. Michael Norman did as well. Dylan Young didn't talk about him too much, but he had a great day. Joshua Collin as well, even with getting involved in a wreck under caution. Um, you see Roy Vaderview, John McNamara, Brandon Viviani. Um, they got Levi Scones, 
and their direct guys, some key names like Jake Cole, Jacob Stump, Eugene the Max, Ryan Acosta, Chris Washer at his home track, uh, Cody Lamas and Sean Henley involved in that first incident. Yeah, that didn't even take long before we uh, got past the checker flag, well not checker flag, green flag. Jessica Shelton out of the race, 31st. A lot of big names out of the race here early. So that was a tough break. But uh, congrats to Kyle Thomas beating the veteran Trent Dunham, season one champion Trent Dunham. And he will be taking home the win here for Joe Gibbs here today. So we'll see you for the cup race. Bye-bye.